It may no longer be news that you say it has allocated over 5 million US dollars for COVID-19 vaccines in Nigeria. But what is interesting for the people and government of Cross River State is that Cross River State is among the eight benefiting states in the country. According to Breakthrough Action Nigeria, an agency funded by USAID since 2020 to support risk communication and community engagement efforts in Nigeria, the funds is in furtherance of the government's efforts to attain 70% vaccination coverage of all eligible adults by September 2020. And Cross River State Government, through the Primary Healthcare Development Agency, says it is making concerted efforts in line with the objective of development partners to achieving these. We are really excited that the level of acceptance has also improved. However, we know there are still a lot of people that are still hesitant, um, but we are hoping that um, with this um, support we are getting and as we are going to intensify our demand creation, sensitization, advocacy, we are hoping that we can uh, really reach as many people as possible. And of course, uh, we know that um, the National Primary Healthcare Development Agency has brought in a new strategy, um, well, um, uh, 3.0, which we hope that um, we'll be able to expand our coverage with these new strategies we're about to impl implement. Since the beginning of the pandemic, according to Nigeria Center for Disease Control, COVID-19 has affected a total number of 256,415 persons in the country, causing the death of 3,144 persons. However, 250,147 lives have been saved, having been treated and discharged from different health facilities across the nation. In Calabar, Maureen Leo Ajom, NTA News.